hi everyone welcome to sparkle beauty so as you can see already today's video is different it's gonna be special in this video i'm gonna be doing my friend's makeup we had a great time filming this video and here is how it turned out so stay with us and hope you'd enjoy watching this video and have a good time with us so let's begin so after prepping her skin i started with the lacme blur perfect primer this is my go-to primer now i use this all the time now next i'm gonna use the milani conceal plus perfect two-in-one foundation in the shade 06 and beige and after applying the foundation i'm going to use a wet sponge to uh, blend it then i'm going to use a highlighting concealer on her face so this is the maybelline concealer in the shade 20 so i'm basically highlighting her under eyes uh, the center of the forehead nose etc and then i'm going to use a contour stick to contour her face i'm using the k beauty concealer stick in the shade coco focus I'm going to contour her face very lightly as it's a Korean makeup look and you don't need to contour the face at all for that. Next I'm going to do her brows. I'm using uh, my Miss Claire eyeshadow pencil. I use this pencil a lot this is one of my favorite it gives a very natural finish and um, it's easy to use and I'm using this in the shade uh, dark brown sorry I'm an eyebrow pencil and now I'm gonna use a concealer on her eyelid to prep it for eyeshadow application setting her under eyes with some loose powder and now I'm gonna set her face with my favorite pack micro finish um, setting spray so for eyes i'm going to be using one of the lacme absolute infinity eyeshadow palette um, i initially decided to use coral charm but then i changed my mind and ended up using pink paradise which is uh, one of my favorite palettes and the eye look is going to be super simple because it's a korean look and um, all we need is just a flush of color on the lid so i'm going to be using this matte pretty pink on her eyelid and then I'm gonna blend it with this matte peach and it's turning out really pretty and fresh then using the same matte pink on the lower lash line And as you can clearly see, my friend is a clown. She loves goofing around and it's always super fun hanging out with her. I've done a makeup multiple times before but it's the first time we're shooting it. And now I'm going to be using some blush. I'm using uh, my favorite sugar blush. It's in the shade 01 Peach Pick. Now I'm going to use some liquid metallic eyeshadow on the eyelid to add some sheen. I'm using my favorite Swiss Beauty liquid metallic eyeshadow in the shade Diamond Dust. For eyeliner, I'm using the Lacme Absolute Shine Line in the shade Black and I'm drawing on some really uh, basic eyeliner which is extended at the end a little. Then I applied some liquid metallic eyeshadow on the inner side of the lower lash line. And now to highlighter, I'm using the Maybelline Master Chrome Highlighter in the shade uh, Rose Gold. Then some white eyeliner on the waterline. Uh, this would make the eyes look bigger. And then I'm adding some brown gold to the outer lash line to add some depth. And finally lipstick. I'm using my favorite uh, Nika Ultra Matte Lipstick in the shade 03 Audrey. This is a beautiful fresh matte pink which goes really well with this look. Mm -hmm. 
and now finally finishing off the eyes with some mascara and lashes i'm using the maybelline hypercurl mascara on the lashes and then i'm gonna use uh, the nika lash talk lashes in the style the og it's a very natural looking lash that can be worn in the daytime especially with looks like these uh, it looks super cute so here is the finished look here is how eyes are looking and this is how she looks after the makeup complete with uh, her hair done and adding, adding on some uh, accessories i hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and don't forget to share this video with your friends subscribe to my channel uh, like this video and hope to see you in my next video till then bye